Good morning, you guys. My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Have suicide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. This is Daily Heat this morning. It's a little different than my other uh, energy checks. It's more general current pulling of the energy. It's supposed to resonate 24 to 72 hours out from the time you view it. However, everyone's on different time and life paths. For so for some of you guys, it can resonate outside the 72 hour time frame. I received a channeled in this morning, so I'm going to go ahead and do it. Um, it's all about Piscean energy in here today, apparently. Um, just saying, just saying. I heard a um, masculine Pisces. Um, some have just found out they have um, impregnated someone they were casually dating. They are not happy about it. Some are about to find out they have impregnated someone. They are casually dating. They are not happy about it. Um, and then I heard a feminine Pisces is about to get robbed soon. Some cyber theft, some their vehicles in public, and some by a family member. So you plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates. Um, heavy, heavy, heavy Piscean energy. Uh, masculine and feminine. Uh, masculines are in, it sounds like, casual, open s type relationships um it doesn't sound like it's serious they might have been dating five people might have been dating 50 people might have been dating three people for all i know only you know your story masculine pisces not anybody else but you're casually um that well you either are still or was recently casually dating it sounds like this person that you impregnated um some you have just found out you have impregnated somebody you were casually dating and you're not happy about it. So I don't think it's somebody that you plan on having in your life um, long term. Um, but obviously y'all are sexually active because um, you're about to find out they're pregnant. I mean, for some, you just found out they're pregnant. For some, you're about to find out they're pregnant. Uh, same situation. I don't feel that you planned on having them in your life permanently um, as like a casual. Uh, I just thought, I mean, I don't think you were planning on having him in your life in like a permanent way is what I'm saying. I think it was just more of a casual sex or casual dating kind of way. Sound like, you know, hook up sex kind of stuff or hook up where we could, you know, not committed kind of thing. Um, either way, whether you just found out this casual dating as type partner is pregnant or you're about to, you're not happy about it. So I don't think you think this person, um, I don't think you wanted this person permanently in your life, is what I'm trying to say. Um, but now they're about to become a permanent part of your life, uh, whether you want them to or not, basically. Um, you can have Pisces in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Hammer, Jupiter, Chart, Masculine, Energy, whoever those are for. And then a feminine Pisces, I heard, is about to get robbed soon. Some, um, their vehicle um, in public, um, some cyber theft, and some by a family member. So you plug it in, however it resonates, if it resonates for you, you if feminine Pisces, you can have Pisces in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, node, mid, haven, or Jupiter charts, however that resonates. Yeah, we have change on the bottom of the deck. Number nine could be a very significant number in one's life. Number nine could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible social security card number, possible um, jersey number, number nine. Huge changes coming here and fast. Some of these robberies are going to be huge, huge dollar amounts. One of these Piscean fem fem feminines will have nothing left after this. Nothing. Oh my God. You plug it in how it resonates. This is terrible. So for the Pisces feminines, they're about to get robbed because we got Pisces, Pisces masculines about to basically find out their baby daddy. Um, and it, does, it doesn't sound like they're happy about it. It doesn't sound like it's somebody they wanted to impregnate, basically. It's somebody that 
I think they thought would be a very temporary part of their life, just like casual dating or third party or secret sneaky link or something like that. However, that resonates. Uh, but I don't feel you, Pisces, Pisces Masculine, wanted this person to be a permanent part of your life, but they're about to be because you're, you're about to be a baby daddy, basically. Um, and they're carrying your child, um, whoever that's for. Um, so huge changes there with that. 555 energy. Um, boom. Got a bean in the in the oven. Got a bun in the oven. Just saying. And um, Pisces Femmes, huge changes because of theft. In this situation, it's monetary theft, I'm feeling. I heard for some, it's going to be um, in your vehicle in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, for some, the vehicle theft could be physical items, I'm feeling. For some, they could be physical items, maybe TVs or electronics or very expensive items in a vehicle because I heard it's in a public space. So, you know, you might have just went shopping. You might have got something really nice and then boom, um, the 60-inch uh, TV is gone out of your back seat. Boom, the uh, five DVD players that you have back there that you were going to distribute throughout your home, your 5,000 square foot home are gone or, um, or something of that nature, how that resonates. Um, but some it's cyber theft and I feel that's monetary and some it is, um, uh, your, uh, family members robbing you. So I feel that could come from a safe or it could come from some kind of money you stash underneath your mattress or in your shoe, or something of that nature. Um, but huge changes coming with money loss. Huge money loss with the Pisces fans, if this resonates for you or somebody you're connected to. And huge changes with a permanent baby mama in some uh, Pisces masculine's life that they did not realize was going to happen. But when you insert a penis into a vagina, and there is no protection, and the sperm enters in with the egg, there's a huge chance it produces a embryo. Boom. Fetus. Boom. Oh, got arms. It's got legs. Oh, it's gestating. Just saying, just saying. <laughs> so, huge changes here. Huge changes. 555 five, five energy. Strong Pisces energy. Mass. Ooh. Pisces masculine, Pisces feminine. Spirit messages you have reflected. High honor reversed. Adjudication reversed. Number 25 or 30 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 25 or 30. It could be possible ages of years somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible social security card number, possible green card number, possible um, jersey number, 25 or 30. High honor reversed. A particular Pisces will end up suing a Libra in energy in one of these situations. A particular Pisces will end up suing a Capricorn in one of these situations. Whoa! What, we're suing people in here? Holy good lord! So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, I heard a particular Pisces is going to end up suing a Libra in one of these situations. Now, you can be masculine or femme Pisces because you have to plug yourself in whether you're on the dude side and pregnating the chick do, or you're a chick Pisces that's getting stole from. Um, I feel for the one, I, I personally feel it might be over here, but you plug it in how it resonates. I heard a Pisces is going to end up suing a Libra over one of these situations, and a Pisces is going to end up suing a Capricorn over one of these situations. So Libra and Capricorn uh, energy, you can have Libra or Capricorn in, your, in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and Midheimer, Jupiter, or Masculine, or Libra or Cap. I don't feel this is the lawsuit energy. 
I feel this might be the lawsuit energy. Because how are you going to sue your baby mama? You agreed to impregnate your baby mama. Um, unless she poked holes in condoms. Um, and I'm serious. I don't feel lawsuit energy over here unless she poked, you can prove she poked holes in condoms or something like that. I feel the lawsuit energy is with the theft. And I, uh, I heard one of these Pisces fans going to end up losing it all. Um, so, I mean, bank account drained or vehicle vandalized or totaled or just everything out of it or a uh, family member just takes the whole damn stash um, that was stored up in the house or something like that. Um, high honor reverse, though. So, there's no high honor here. There's no honor in this situation. There's no honor amongst thieves. Just for real, for real. Um, there's no honor... Just knocking up somebody you're randomly dating. Um, I mean, I guess some people will consider that high honor. I don't, but uh, I don't feel that's high honor. But, and just saying, just saying, you're pulling high honor reverse. I feel, Pisces dudes, if this resonates for you, I feel your family's probably going to be like, of course, you know, I don't, I mean, you can take it or leave it. You might be all in that societal cry for not. I'm not sure. If it was me, I'd be like, whatever. That's the choice I made. You can quit judging. But um, you might. I don't know. But I feel some of your families are going to judge with the high honor reverse is what I'm trying to say. I feel some of your families are going to judge you. Um, but, you know, that's the choice you made. As long as you pay some child support and you are a good parent, um, that's really what matters here. But I do feel the high honor reverse is judgmental from other people is what I'm trying to say. And if you're not, if you don't get along with baby mama, that very well, that could be high honor reverse too, because of not good co-parenting. But you plug it in how it resonates. This is straight up high honor reverse. You shouldn't steal from somebody. You shouldn't freaking steal from somebody. Perry fucking ad. We got family members stealing from a Pisces fam. We've got possible Libra and Capricorn energy in the families possibly. Um, we've got uh, cyber theft. Possible Libra and Capricorn energy. And we've got, uh, what was the other one? Uh, vehicle theft in a public space. Possible Libra and Capricorn energy. No honor amongst thieves. Judication reversed. For some of these Pisces feminines, they have severely stole from someone. So they cannot file in the court of law. Oh, my Lord. Well, this is getting worse. Well, this is a high honor uh, reverse, too. That would make sense. Some of these Pisces fans, they have stole from someone else. So they cannot go and file in the court of law because they have stole from somebody else. So maybe somebody in the courthouse, they know that they stole from somebody. Or they know about the situation or something like that. So um, I guess they can't go to, you know, small claims or if there's large, I'm assuming there's probably large claims or whatever the hell. They can't go file for the theft, basically. You plug it in how it resonates. This is whatever. This is crazy. And one of these Pisces masculines is going to have to pay out a very, very, very large amount of money in child support when it comes. They make very, very, very good money. Oh, one is a lawyer, one is a nurse, one is an engineer. Oh, okay. So lawyer, nurse, or engineer, Pisces masculine that has knocked up a casual dating partner. That, that could be the honor too. I heard you're going to have to end up paying a lot of money in child support um, when all this, when the baby gets here basically, um, because, um, because you make good money, basically. Um, and whoever you've been sleeping with, they obviously know obviously know you do. So I I think in those situations, they're definitely going to keep the kid because they want the child support. <laughs> I mean, duh. Uh, for one, you're a nurse. For some, you're, one, you're a lawyer. And one, you're an you're engineer. So you have to plug it in however it resonates, if that resonates for you. Wow. Yeah, so you have very respectful careers. And your family are probably going to be like, what the crap did you do? <laughs> Um, but you know, it's your life, man. I don't judge nobody. You live, you honey, boo boo. All right, let me see if I hear anything else.
Okay, I didn't. All right, I hope this helped. Love you guys so much. Namaste.